Hi guys, uh, welcome to TechPress with yet another video. In this video, I'm, I'm going to talk about how to set up, you know, you see that something moves as I adjust my wheel, raise wheel on this obvious. That's the wheel of animation. You can actually, instead of using pedal or steering wheel cam, uh, as you refer the video of your sim rising, you can actually use this instantly. So you don't have to set up separate cams for recording your pedals and steering. So you know, as you do this, you can see that as I uh, press the clutch pedal or the brake or the uh, acceleration pedals, so you can see the animation here. So what I'm doing. So you don't actually have to set up separate cams to capture all this stuff. Uh, you could uh, just use this application instead on your OBS. So in this video, I'll show you how to set this up. I'm going to post this, okay? So then you need to go here. So in this URL, billiam.h.io. And here you can actually download this application called Wheeler. So here you can see that how actually things work. There is a small animation on the right end of this website. And here you can see the configuration and setup things and how you actually set this up. So first you need to download it and then all you have to do is just uh, go to the download folder that you have downloaded it and open the zip folder and you have this feeder uh, in the zip folder, okay? So first I'm going to run this application. I have I already deleted the configuration so I have to reconfigure it again. So I'm gonna launch the wheeler.exe from this um, zip folder, okay? So let's load it. Okay, now you can see this small configuration file. So press C to configure. That's what it says. All you have to do is just press C and it'll ask you to do the next step to configure it. Okay, so I'm gonna press C now. Okay, so turn wheel to lock. So now you need to turn the wheel, okay? Turn the wheel to lock. So now it identified my wheel. So that's like that uh, G29. So yeah, that's it. Now you can click enter, okay? Click enter. Now hold the wheel at 90 degree. Now you need to hold the wheel to its, at its 90 degree. Okay, just, just half rotation of your wheel, that's it. This much. Hold it like that and click enter, okay? Then press the throttle pedals, the acceleration pedal, that's what it says, the throttle pedals, the, so that the car moves and it actually animates. So I'm going to press the throttle pedal, okay? So it recognizes the pedal, okay? Then click uh, enter. Then, it'll ask, it, then it's asking you to press the brake pedal. So press that. So yeah, it got it. Then click continue. Then press clutch button. The next is clutch button. Okay. Press continue. Then press handbrake. Handbrake in my case, I don't have any handbrake here. Just gonna skip it. I don't want it. Then I'm gonna shift up. So you have uh, this shifter on your wheel. So you need to one shift up. This is the shift up. Okay. Then click enter. Then the shift down on your left. So click enter. So on G29, uh, you have shifter as well, right? So you, the one on the right and one on the left of your wheel, uh, at the right behind the wheel, right? So yeah, then it's asking you to set up the gear. So if you have shifter, other shifter, you need to set that one as well. So what you needed to do is just, you don't need to press the clutch here. You just need to turn the first gear on. Okay, so that's it. Then click enter, then second gear. So click enter, then shift it to third, third, then click enter, then fourth, then click enter, then fifth, then click enter, then sixth, then click enter. There is no seventh gear, so you, you can actually just skip it okay then and reverse so you need to use the you need to make sure that you turn the reverse on okay so you need to push it down and do it now it's reverse 
So then click enter. So it's ready to use. Now you can see that animation here. You see that as a crystal flash gray and the toggle pedal. You can see that animation here. Also, at the shift click here, you see it. Four, five, six, and the reverse. So, Yes, this is reverse. So you see that? That's how it works. Um, okay, anyway, almost ready. So after that, what you need to do is just just uh, add a mm, game capture window. Here you can add any of the, here is a game capture, okay? Add a game capture uh, source uh, on obvious source. Then name it whatever you want. I have named it like the wheeler of a like, game capture. Then on the mode, choose capture specific window instead of capture any full screen application, okay? Capture specific window. Then here for window, choose wheeler, okay? Then check this allow transparency. So then click OK. Now you can see that the wheel is there. So as you set this up on and on obvious as well, you see this animation. See that? It's really cool, right? As you play the game, especially as you stream or record the video, and it will be recorded as well. And once you post it on YouTube. Uh, your viewers have idea how you actually use your wheel and uh, the shifter as well and uh, other flash phones or whatever. So it's really cool thing, you know, instead of using a straight um, cam setup for your steering wheel and pedals, you can actually use this animation shift. That's a cool way to utilize this tool. So guys. I think this dude actually who developed this small application does deserve your donation. So if you if you're going to download it, maybe you should uh, you should make a donation because it's well worth it. So I hope actually this helps. So guys, don't forget to like and subscribe. Uh, also share the video again with your friends and others um, who may also find this really helpful. Right? Okay, guys. Thanks.